Well, I'm enjoying some real old good old time frustration here. Um, I showed you guys a program that I used earlier called Guitar Tracks Pro 3. And you can lay all these tracks on here as many as you need to. And, uh, lay down your rhythm track and then come back and do your vocals each on a different track. You can lay down your melody and then you can come back and listen to that. And, sing harmony with it and lay, lays down on another track and then you mix that all down and uh, I discovered that uh, mixing is uh, almost like learning to play another instrument I mean I'm not that great at it but I I did uh, learn a little bit about it I'm looking for a file here right quick uh, But uh, anyway, I upgraded to um, this other program called Guitar Tracks Pro 4, which is compatible with, uh, you know, my newer system with Windows 7 or XP or whatever. And Guitar Tracks 3 is pretty old. So um, when I upgraded to uh, this new program, I found it's a huge program, and it has a lot of features, more features than I will ever learn how to use, I'm sure. But with that old program, you can lay down all these tracks, and uh, and uh, I'll give you an example. I laid down every track on here. This is all just one person that you hear doing all this stuff. And uh, if I can get it to go here, this is just an example of what you can do. Lay down your rhythm, your lead, your fills and runs, and you know, uh, mandolin, uh, gas can guitar, whatever you want. Then you can sing harmony with yourself. That's the deal, you know, that's how it's supposed to work. you get the idea and you can take those tracks and you can pan left and pan right and you can add uh, 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 you can add lines in there to, to change the volume and you can put nodes in that line and raise and lower the volume in certain places and you can put sounds up there and back there and down here and over here and back around over here and it's really kind of fun but uh, when I got this new program here uh, it comes with it it comes it comes with with uh, this kind of stuff. It's got a whole drum kit here, all these drums, and it's got a uh, bass guitar kit, and you can do all these different bass runs, and they'll put them in for you, I guess, when you learn how to loop it and all that. Now I don't know yet. Uh, that's my issue here. There's quite a learning curve. I can fake the bass a little. I mean, I've got a bass look guitar. I can fake that a little bit. I don't know how to play it, but I can alternate the bass line on in each key, and that's all I know how to do, but but you can kind of fake it, you know, and make it sound like it's got some bass behind it. And throw in some mandolin chops. I don't know how to play a mandolin either, you know, but uh, anyway. Um, this is a pretty complicated program, and uh, I'm having a terrible time figuring it out. Now here's the problem right here. This is the instruction book. I can't read an instruction book. I can build a hot rod, but I can't from the ground up, but I can't read one of these. When my kids were little and they wanted to buy a computer uh, game, I'd teach them to shake the box. If it's heavy, you don't want it because you've got a big old thick book in there, you know. But uh, 
somehow my son he overcame that. <laughs> he reads the books and and he can do it but I just you know I just can't learn out of a book I, I uh, never could I gotta get if I can get my hands on it I can figure out how it works but I can't get my hands in there I'm frustrated but I'll get over it because that's what you do you just keep going and you know I'm I've read about half this thing don't understand it but I've read it so I guess I'm gonna go back and read it again anyway I guess you can see I got cabin fever see you later i